what is print on demand and how is it helpful to me? So Teddy, what, what is print on demand and how is it going to be helpful to our authors? Okay, um, print on demand is, a, is quite a revolutionary concept. It's been around in other places around the world, um, a few years in Australia, but hasn't been uh, very common amongst authors until recently. The basic concept is that you don't print thousands of books and decorate your garage. Here, you only print books as and when you need them, i.e. the book of woman. Yeah, so basically, so when someone orders at the bookstore, we can then print one book and send it to the bookstore for the one customer. Absolutely. So if the customer wants five, how many, would, how many do we print? We print five. Well, that explains it pretty well. So the other benefit of it is that there's no warehousing. So once again, as Tony mentioned, a lot of people have a lot of unsold books in their garages, so you totally prevent that, So, which means you don't outlay as much money initially, and also it's good for the environment because you don't have unwanted books. Exactly. So, once again, save money, no out of pocket. And just to add on the no out of pocket terms, yep. uh, it's actually that when books were previously sold, Someone had to pay for the books, so the author would need to pay for a thousand books to be printed and then they recoup their investment as the book is sold. Mm. With print and demand, the author actually doesn't even pay for the books uh, to be printed. Because, mm. we, because we print it so fast, we can print it after it's ordered by the bookstore. That's right. So you, we, we, our authors don't have to keep any stock with us at all. No. And they have no out-of-pocket expense. Mm, great. And obviously, we believe that's the future of book production. Ab absolutely. Um, I mean, it's uh, no secret. Most published books by, all, by big publishers, they only sell 18 copies uh, at a time. So there's no way they're going to keep investing thousands of books uh, as opposed to when they can print one or two or ten books at a time to test the market. That's right, and the average of 18 books, that's not our stats, that's actually from Nielsen book that data, so that's very accurate stats. Yeah, exactly. So we're not making any of this up at no, all. No, not at all.